a little disclaimer before we start this video. This is probably the like fifth attempt that I tried this video. So until this goes good. So in today's video, I'm gonna be talking to you guys about where I've been for the last two or three months. I have no idea where I've been. No, I know where I've been, but I um don't know how long it has been. And why I am making my return to YouTube right now. Why? Like, what is this video for? So, let's get right into it. So, where I have been these last two or three months, um, I've actually never left. I've been on YouTube from time to time. I've, I've just been watching other people because, you know, I haven't opened Roblox Studio in, like, two months three months i have no idea how long it has been but since the k things by for now video i haven't opened up the roblox studio that much i opened up roblox studio today um because on the day i'm recording this which is um august 2nd i believe um i've been i have been just you know not in the right like i just haven't been feeling right to record a scripting video and since k things by for now i i said that i was editing some scripting videos you guys are gonna want to see and i was editing them but i just didn't feel like it was me i felt like that the videos that i was creating that the videos i'm currently creating are not me they're not what i want to do and so i am changing my entire channel perspective to focus on me playing games i know that um you guys that make may have came here for just like scripting because you want to learn how to script and everything but um i think that's not what i want my channel to be and that's not what i want to be known for is like a roblox scripter on youtube i i want to be i want to be doing the things that i love which is like um playing games and obviously i'm creating my own games and yes i know i am so scripting is scripting is still there, but I just I don't feel like making content on it. I feel like making content on gaming. So I think this might be the last video that I create of me talking about my channel and how we want how so much how I want to change it. And um, the last times I did this, like nobody was watching them, and I and I understand because I was gonna sit through me ranting about my channel and how I want to change it. So, this is why at the end of this, I'm giving you guys some bug fixes for how to script a cafe, so you keep keep a watch on that. I am put, I'm not putting timestamps on this, because I know people are just going to skip right to that, and um, I want everyone to watch this all the way through, so they know what's going on when I don't post any scripting content for like a very long time. Now, I know I'm not very much of a pro scripter, as most people like to call, they say I like, they like to call me a pro scripter. I don't think I'm a pro scripter. I think there's many other pro scripters out there that you guys can definitely learn to script from. I think I've been very much of a help through my How to Script a Cafe series, which is still going to go on even though I'm not doing um, scripting content every so often now. I'm still going to continue that until its run is over. Um, and when I say the run is over, the run is over, but it's going to take a while for me to record and just get everything through there. So, um, that's, and that's another thing is that I want to start putting content out for you guys very, very, very easily. And I've tried to pre-record some videos and actually after this video, I'm going to start pre-recording some more videos that are, that are to come. Um, and I'm gonna like start pre-recording videos now, but I don't feel like pre-recording like scripting videos because then like as I'm pre-recording I'm just gonna lose interest in it very easily because I don't know how to script everything and um, So yeah, like I hope that you guys will stay here that you guys would um Enjoy my gaming content because I'm sure you'll like it like Bed Wars, but I keep dying or Bed Wars I keep calling the void or Bed Wars, but I never win a single game um, Like I'm planning on doing like Minecraft and maybe like the Minecraft survival series with my sister who also has a YouTube channel And that I'm not linking in the description just yet. I'll do that when we actually do a video together um, But you know, maybe at some point I will do a survival series on YouTube, which is something I've done before, and I 
stop doing it. Like, there was um, one of the series called Aquatic Adventures. It was a really fun series that I did. We were, um, we were just exploring the, um, the, the, the new aquatic update in Minecraft. And then the village update. The village and pillage update. I did pre-village and pillage. And I wanted to do a series called Village and Pillage. And I just didn't do it. Because I... Because no one was really watching them, and I knew that not everyone and, and nobody was gonna continue watching them. And I know you have to start from somewhere as a YouTuber, and you're not gonna you're not gonna get everyone engaged in your videos. And um, I'm hoping that I could do that with the second round of gaming content. And I keep dying in this hobby. I trash at hobbies. Um, but really, what I'm saying is, I'm not gonna be a Roblox YouTuber scripter anymore. I'm going to be I'm still gonna be a Roblox YouTuber, but I'm gonna be playing games. I'm also gonna be switching it up maybe each week. Maybe one week I do Roblox and the next week I just do like um I do Minecraft and you know just keep it fresh for each week that I post videos. And I'm hoping that I'm gonna do two videos per week. Um I think in my last I'm back video I said like we're doing one video per week and if we get one thousand subscribers we're gonna get two videos per week. But I'm deciding that it's gonna be two videos per week. Um, and if you guys decide that you guys like gaming content, you like my gaming content, then I'll continue doing the two videos per week. Um, because my passion is doing YouTube and bringing videos out there uh, for you guys and whether you guys like it. Um, I want to bring videos out to you guys that you guys would like. Wow. Alright, so I, d I do want to do that and, um... But I feel like that, um, first I have to, like, promote the idea of, um, to stop doing scripting and, you know, inside of a scripting video so that more people are going to watch it and know. Because that's the only way that I'm going to get to do that because no one's going to watch my other videos. Like, why? Like, that that's something that I'm frustrated about is that if I post anything other than scripting, I get no viewers on the channel. Like, my views would slip. Like, if you look at um some of my videos you would see that um that only my scripting videos are the ones that have like hundreds of views and like, some of my videos that i don't do scripting they're gonna get they're getting hundreds of views my old how to script the cafe series that was getting like that, that got like thousands of views like there's one of them i believe with 26,000 26, views and like that's really cool i think that was probably like two years ago like 2018 until or three years ago, which I don't remember, but you know, it'll be shown on the screen as you guys can see. Like, wow! Like, why can't I get those much viewers on um on my other videos that I do? Like, why is it only on my scripting videos? Um, but um, I do hoping that you guys will stick around to watch those. Um, because maybe like a hundred viewers per video that I upload will be pretty fun um but yeah i hope if you guys do want to continue um what should i how am i supposed to put this if you guys do want to see more gaming content and you like gaming content you like watching other youtubers play games and like deliberately fail at them like fail at them then subscribe to this channel like if you're new subscribe to the channel um if you are new and you're looking for more scripting content, I'm very, very sorry that you have to come through this video and see that we are no longer doing scripting videos on this channel. I just don't have a passion for it anymore. I feel like my passion is for playing games since I'm playing games like almost 24-7 on Roblox instead of being in Roblox Studio. I feel like that Roblox scripters are going to be in Roblox Studio 24-7 making videos for their channel. But for me, I'm just mostly in, uh, in games. And I think that's where I'm coming from, like where I'm not being so active on this channel because I'm not, not in Roblox Studio. But I do put myself in Roblox Studio. Um, I'm probably getting out like maybe two minutes of a video to script, and like it's just it's, it's just not for me. So um, yeah, make sure hit make sure you subscribe, hit the notification bell, and click all so you never miss an upload. Also, join my Discord server because I'm going to be very active there and you will also get notified when a video is uploaded for you guys to watch. Um, and you also get to interact with other people who are in there. Um, you'll get a very special role for the first 100 members that join the Discord server. Um,
and yeah, so make sure you do join that. And I think this is enough ranting. Oh wait, no, there's something else that I do want to talk about. So if you guys look through my channel, you'd see that there's more gaming content than scripting. Um, when I created this channel, I believe in 2015, um, I was doing gaming videos because I was inspired by other YouTubers who play games and do that. Like Minecraft, I believe was like was a lot of things that people were a lot of a lot of YouTubers were creating Minecraft videos at that time, and I'm like, I want to be a Minecraft YouTuber. I want to be a YouTuber, and like you know, it's a and like you know, someone's gonna have to start somewhere. And I guess that maybe if I start here now, um, I it's it's gonna happen. And then I and then I joined Roblox in 2016, um, and Roblox has such a pot, such much more of a possibility to record videos. And I'm on Roblox like almost 24/7, the same as Discord. So join my Discord server. Link is in the description. I'm gonna keep promoting this throughout the video. Like, join my Discord server, like now. Like it, it's waiting for you. It's calling for you. Like you, you who's watching the video, join my Discord server. Um, but um, I solely created this channel to play games. Like obviously, play games and everything. And, um, in my recent videos, I've just been showcasing games, I've been in obbies, doing a voiceover and everything, because, you know, that's something that I want to do, and, like, you haven't gotten a single scripting video, like, I think the last two newer scripting videos that I posted out was, like, automatic rank, uh, not automatic rank, a automatic uniforms, where when you join into a server, or join into your game, you get your uniform for your staff right away, or however you programmed it, and then How to Scope to Cafe, the new How to Scope to Cafe Part One of Ranked Doors, the more in depth series. Um, I think those are the last two scripting videos that I posted. And there's actually a few more scripting videos that I did want to put out, which is like more How to Scope to Cafe, and then maybe like um. See, I don't remember what videos I want to put out because you know I don't want to do I just don't want to do it anymore. So um. I know some of you are gonna like, you know, want me to make those type of videos, but um, I think good things do have to come to an end, and um, I think that for me, scripting it wasn't gonna be like an all-time thing, um, and I, and I I didn't just do a lot of people are just gonna think that I just did scripting to get my subscriber base growing so that I can just be like you know grow bigger, but I have no idea how to put that. But you know, I did scripting because it was something that I liked at the time, and um, you know, a lot of YouTubers they move, they, a lot of YouTubers move from making Among Us videos and went to just doing other games. And, like, you know, a lot of YouTubers do move things, and you know, I'm moving from scripting to just playing games, and that's something I want to solely do. And, um, and if I and I'm gonna start live streaming soon, something I do want to do, um, so that's something that I want to put out soon. So. Yeah, I think this is enough of me ranting. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys in the next part of this video, which will be um, the Bug Fixes Photo Script Account Fame, which I believe part 7 or part 8 of the old series, and part 2 of the new series, which I'm putting this in the old series because, you know, it's just, um... It, yeah, you'll see. But, you know, I'll see you guys in the next, in the next part of this video. So, let's just hop right over there all right so you guys have seen the last um like the first part of this video and now we're gonna go into the second part of this video so no more ranting and on to the next part of the bug fixes on how to script a cafe so the first things first that we want to do is we want to know the cause of the bugs so if you know the cause of your bugs then make sure that you um, follow along with this tutorial on how to fix your bugs depending on what bugs you have with the with, with the with the scripting part or anything. So I'm gonna start going with the first episode, which the first episode was the rank door. I will be linking the first part of the second series of um how to script a cafe, so part one of the part two thing. Um that goes more in depth of how I um do the rank door so you guys can get your rank door to work so i'll link that in the description or probably the little i button up here if i 
figure out how that works. If I do figure out how it works, it'll be in the eye up on the top right corner, I believe it is, on the top right corner. So click that, um, and you'll be able to um, get to the video. If not, just look right into the description. So the rank door, I go more in depth of that. Um, so it should be can collide is checked off, can touch anchored and archivable are on. So that should be that. And um, I think it was like in starter packet. And then the doors folder, everything should be the same here. Um, it, I believe in the original script on one of the um, videos, I did this as um, I did a few um, mistakes. But on the new one, go to the new one and it should have no mistakes on it. So um, yeah. So with that aside, I don't, don't remember what the second part was, but I believe the second part was the cups, the cup givers and everything. So we're going to go into the cup givers because that's just the order of events that I want to do right now. So the, a lot of people have trouble with getting the tool into their hand. So make sure that your thing is called cup giver or you, or you could just name it giver, I believe. Just like giver, D depending on what it is. But I name mine cup giver, so that helps me a lot with cup giver. Um... You can do empty cup, your, so empty cup has to be empty cup right here with the click detector inside of the empty cup. Now, what other people were having is as they go into the dispensers, they don't, so let's just say we're going to go to cappuccino. All right, script go to cappuccino, function head, script. All right, so they're looking for, the because like they're not getting the milk to appear or they're not getting the cappuccino to appear and the milk to disappear. So there is an easy fix for that. So you go to wherever you stored your cup. I believe you would have stored it in server script service or server storage. Depending on where what video told you to put it in, it should be in both of them. So I don't know which one, so just update all of them. Um, so when you open up your empty cup, you should be having all your drinks up here, like a cappuccino, carbonation, milk, orange smoothie, orange soda, and your water. Um, what what people were having problem with was that they were um, putting they were putting all of this into the handle, so everything was now in the handle. You don't want to put it inside the handle. You want to put it right inside of the cup, um, and inside of our gift handler. It's in server storage, so I think it'll probably work if you take it out of server script service. But I don't know. I would have to look into that. But for right now, I don't know. You guys can try that. If it doesn't work, then put it back in the server script service and everything. So it should work like that. Make sure you have all the scripts, like the give handler. Um, you can pause and copy this if you don't have this. Make sure it's in service and service, and it may, and it's and it is named give handler. All right. Now, also in this, you want to have a local script called give handler. So this will get your mouse. This will get the player, get the mouse, and get your give event. And then it'll also make sure it finds the click detector, and it'll and then it will go to give. So right in our events, our give thing, it's going to fire that um, and get the target.name. In events, you should also have this. It's the same script as before, but inside of events. Um, I don't think you might need that, but for like, um, just in case, just in case you want to do that. Um, but yeah, that should make sure you pause the script. If you, if you think you made an error in the script, make sure you pause the video and do and edit your scripts um, so that you can get all your bugs fixed in your game, your cafe, your restaurant, whatever you're making that you're using this for. Um, I don't think anyone else, I, I know a lot of people are having problems with flavors. Um, so what you want to do is you just want to just get your next favorite machine. Um, this should be really named um, color part. So I probably will fix that in the models. So what you want to do is you just want to like, Edit all your stuff, so I'm going to change this orange to grape. Alright, so it'll be just like grape. Alright, there you go, you have your little grape. Um, present script. So then over here, then you just change everything to like grape soda. Alright, now you have your grape soda, you have your grape cappuccino, and you also have your grape milk. And there's a different way that you, that you probably want to do this. I think what you do is up here, you do like local flavor equals grape. So that like there, and then you just remove this. You do dot dot flavor dot dot. 
no, I think it's flavor dot dot. Yeah. Flavor dot dot, and you have a space between that for grape soda. I think that's how you do it. And if this does work, then do this. So I'll probably do this in a the How to Serve to Cafe new series part two, flavor machines and all of that. Just jazz, but um, since this is like the last gifting video, it's gonna be premiering for a while. I say that this probably will work. Yeah, this should work because local flavor equals grape. So you have your flavor defined right here. So then you can just literally copy all of this right here. Oops, oops. Control C. So you have all your flavors right. Here. You specify your flavor here. So then in your files, you just change this. Let's just say it. now we have a honey. A honeydew flavor. So then this should be honeydew soda. And if you have this as honeydew cappuccino, honeydew milk, all of that. So I'll update the model files um, so you guys can get the brand, the, the newest model files. Um, well, let me delete that. Okay, now we are going to go on to. So here, now a lot of people don't know how to make other drinks or recipes. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to help you make your recipe. So you just want to copy your um, current recipe that you have and then let's say hot milk let's say this is like um some let's come up with a name let's just say this is coffee all right just a generic kit okay and then all right now we have it in the cappuccino machine let's just say new coffee all right and you just change it you change your like H dot parent, whatever this was named, so I named that coffee. And then this was new coffee. C O F F E E. So like new coffee, like really easy to do that, but I'm not gonna do that, so your pastries should be working fine if you have um your own pastries folder with your cake, chocolate. Chocolate cake pop, chocolate cookie or croissant, muffin s'more, um, strawberry cake pop, sugar cookie, and vanilla cake pop. Depending on whatever you have in here, make sure that all of these are named, whatever this is. Now we're going to go back here. And I think maybe have people have issues with getting your um, pastries. So I'm going to go inside of the cake. Inside of the click, you have your script right here with your click detector. So now you're going to, it's going to start up with a function. So if you, if your script and your pastry does not look like this, pause the video and write out this script right now. So right here we have function, pastry, and with a parentheses, which is an X, so this will, so this defines as pastry as X. So your pastry is now X. Um, so Y equals X dot backpack. So this will um, define, I think X will be the player, not the pastry. So X dot backpack, so that would usually be like, player dot backpack so I think X is player. I'm sorry, I don't know my own scripts. I should know them. Um then you have Z equals game replicated storage pastries cake. So that just gets your um your um tool which is the cake in our um for our our thing. And then it takes the Z and clones it and it sets the parent as Y which puts it in the player's backpack. And then after this it just connects the fun it connects all the function together and it just and it executes the pastry function. So if you guys have this copied and you didn't pause the video, good for you. You should have no bugs now. But if you guys did copy everything and you guys had a ton of bugs, I'm so sorry the bugs have happened to you. Um, I hope you got those fixed. And if they didn't, go into my Discord server. Link is in the description. You would already know from the beginning of this video. But link is in the description to go watch that. Um, since we already got in the car, since we already got in the stuff down, the carbonation and the orange thing should be the same. But what should be different in the flavor machine is in the function ahead in the present script. This should just be water and carbonated water, and it's also the same thing with this. So everything should be working if you have your flavor machines working. And if you didn't, go back to where the flavor machine was, or go back to the where the carbonation was. Like here, I'll open it. You guys can pause it right here and get your carbonation working if it's not working for you. So get that working. And if your if your carbonation's still not working, it's probably a problem with the water. Make sure that the water inside of the part right here is like never mind. That's a script that never been used. Um 
right here. So make sure that it's empty cup and water and make sure that it's exactly the same. So pause this if you're also having a problem with the water. So everything should be working now. You should have no problems in your game. And if you still do, the ice is the, exactly the same thing. I can show you how easy it is to change everything. So it's just orange milk, ice orange milk. All right, so we have control C, control V, your basic computer things. Now we just, we're going to, we're going to, we're, we're probably selling tea at our cafe because we are really good tea givers. So we are the tea givers. Um, so now we have iced tea now. So it's just really easy. You just do tea, iced tea. That's it. And if you want to have ice shown, you can just do h.parent dot ice dot transparency so dot trans i'm gonna shorten it up because i'm not going to do anything with this equals um zero so that's how easy it is but it, instead of saying trans just put transparency if you have ice in your cup um i think that if you guys are not have if you guys are having a problem with ice pause the video and do that um you guys shouldn't have any more problems now so that should be it for the video um And, um, yeah, I hope that fixes all of your issues because I am not, wait, hold on. I hope that fixes all your issues because uh, this is the last scripting video that's going to be on this channel for a while. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy. And if you guys did, make sure you hit the subscribe button and hit the post notification bell and click all so you never miss a video. Never miss whenever I post, and also join my Discord server because I will always update you guys in my Discord server when a new video is posted. So definitely go check out that. Um, and farthermost, um, and going on with this, uh, I'm sorry, I'm just running out of things to talk. That's why I don't really like doing scripting because it's just not a lot for me to talk about. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this, and if you guys did, you guys will definitely enjoy my gaming content so be sure to check out my gaming content um i believe this is part seven of the original series and part two of the so this is going through okay so let's just have this going through our original series all right not the next series so whatever part this is it's the last part of this series and yeah um i hope you guys did enjoy and i want to thank everyone for being here this long um this is not a goodbye to my channel because i'm coming back I believe maybe next week or in a few days with a brand new video that you guys are going to love because it's a game that I play in my free time and uh, um, I've actually um, going to head out to I'm actually going to get off this and record this uh, probably tomorrow and edit this uh, a few days later and then get it out um, but yeah when you're seeing this I'm probably off recording the next video if, if not then yeah, but I'll see you guys in the next one, and I hope you guys do enjoy the next gaming video. Bye!